Also breaking from us at five, it's a story that has captivated the Gulf Coast for nearly a decade. People who've lived here a while know the name Brittany Wood. It's been nearly eight years since she vanished without a trace. No body, no arrest, and no definitive answers about what happened. However, Mobile Police are hoping that all changes with a new picture that they released today. Fox News Tyler Fingered is live at MPD headquarters with the details. Tyler? Yeah, hey, good evening, Byron. That picture is an age progress photo of what Brittany Woods would likely look like today. Take a look at that picture. It was done by the National Center for Missing and Exploited Children uh, for the Mobile Police Department. It shows Wood at the age of 27, which is how old she would be today. The then 19 year old mother was last seen at her uncle's house near Styx River in 2012 and hasn't been seen since. That same uncle, Donnie Holland, killed himself just days later and Mobile Police say he is the prime suspect in her disappearance. In the months and years after Brittany's disappearance, nearly a dozen of Woods' family members were arrested, some later prosecuted in Mobile and Baldwin counties as part of a child sex abuse ring. There have been numerous searches for Woods since 2012, but still nothing that points to exactly what happened to her. Just moments ago, I spoke with the MPD lead investigator on the case. He says they're going to continue to work to get answers, but at this point, he fears the worst. Take a listen. Well, obviously, this has been this has been eight years now, and we have not heard anything from Brittany in all this time. Um, the likelihood is that she's probably deceased, um, but we have never stopped working the case. We've uh, continued to work it. We we follow up on any leads that we get, uh, even now. Eight years later, we still follow up on any leads that come in. Um, so we we've never stopped working at anything that that we get that comes in. Um, so if whether she's deceased or if she's alive, either way, we're still investigating the case. Mobile police say that they have evidence that points that they may be it, that she may be in a certain area, but they did not specify where exactly that area is. If you have any tips, you are asked to call Mobile police. We did try to reach out to Brittany Woods's mother today. However, she was not available to go on camera, but in the past she has said she is going to continue searching for her daughter. We're live in Mobile tonight. Tyler Finger, Fox 10 News.